Let's take a look at the procedure required to replace the MAP sensor, Manifold Absolute Pressure Sensor, on this 4.7 liter engine in this Dodge Durango. Now you see we've got a vacuum port, and this is going to measure vacuum directly from the upper intake plenum. And so this is mounted uh, in the front of the engine here, and so it's not too bad to get at the electrical connector and disconnect that. We also want to disconnect the connector for the engine coolant temp sensor though. That's going to give us a little more room to work here if we get that out of our way. Now I'm going to take my T15 Torx bit with about an 8 inch extension here and my quarter inch ratchet. And there's two screws holding this into place in the upper intake plenum. So I'm just going to break them loose here with a ratchet. Once those are broken free, I'll just spin them loose here by hand. And we have to be careful not to drop this down on the intake. Now, we can take our new MAP sensor. You'll see it's got an O-ring here. We can slide that into place. Pop it in so it's sealed off. We need to insert our two screws. We'll make our electrical connections again. And you don't have to worry about crossing these up. This MAP sensor is a three-wire sensor. The coolant temp sensor is just a two-wire sensor. We'll make our connections, clear any trouble codes that may have been set, reinstall our air breather assembly here, and the vehicle is ready to go. We've just replaced the manifold absolute pressure sensor on this 4.7 liter engine.